space here in Bell Tower. And I'm starting with Andrew this morning because you came up with the idea of zero empty spaces. And for people who don't know, what is it? So zero empty spaces, we take over vacant commercial real estate um, in various iterations, whether it's a shopping center like this one or street level retail, and we turn them into working artist studios. So customers are able to see artists working. So a lot of times, you know, people see a finished piece, but they don't see the process. And we feel that, you know, when you're able to see the process, you really have a deeper appreciation for art. Okay, very cool. And not only do you get to see the process, but is it kind of difficult for artists to find a working space? Yes. I mean, most of the affordable artist studio spaces are not necessarily in the best of areas. So okay. being able to be at a place like Bell Tower mm -hmm. um, is just really a, an amazing opportunity for artists. It's kind of a mix between having your own studio and having your own gallery. And the way, way it works, you artists pay um, uh, one fee that includes all the utilities. Oh, cool. And whatever they sell, they keep. So we don't take any commissions off of any of the work that they sell. Oh, that's so awesome. So this is their opportunity to be able to kind of be their own gallery owners. OK. Uh, but in this kind of commercial environment. That's awesome. So yeah. this one's located here in Bell Tower in Fort Myers. But there's other zero empty spaces. Yes. Throughout the state? Yes, we have uh, we have Virginia. one in St. Pete, uh, okay. we have Virginia, we have Massachusetts, uh, we have several in South Florida. Okay. So we're continuously growing, you know, wherever we're needed, we're there. What a genius idea. And so if you're watching and you're not an artist, but you really appreciate art or you're looking for something to go into your living room, you can come out here and purchase art from local artists as well. You can, yeah. And if you go to zeromspaces.com, you're able to actually see all the spaces we have virtual walkthroughs. So you can actually see what the space looks like online before you even get here, see the artists that are here. So yes, they're okay. very, very exciting. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for being here this morning. No, thank you. Of course. We did convince a few artists to wake up early with us, too. So may, let's start over here with Tammy. Good morning. Good morning. So first, I guess, just really quickly, tell me about the art that you create. This looks like very Southwest Florida. Uh, yes, very <laughs> Southwest Florida. Um, it's my, beautiful. Yes. Uh, my interest in uh, tropical scenery started in Hawaii. I lived in California for 16 years. Awesome. And then uh, it was an easy transition to Southwest Florida and all the beauty that we have here. 100%. And yeah. It's gorgeous. Deja Thank and I were you. just talking about the wave in the back and how, you know, artists can create waves like this. Mind blowing. I mean, that's stunning. It could be a picture. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you for letting us get a glimpse into your artistic mind. If you want to come out and meet Tammy, you can here at empty, or Zero Empty Spaces in Bell Tower. Thank you. Great. Thank we're you. We're going to run next door to Angela. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Tell me about your art. You're an art on like very many levels uh, in artists. A, a few. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, I, I really started a year ago. I don't really know why I do what I do. Okay. It's more like therapy for me. I love that. Um, there's a whole backstory to why I got involved with uh, art, but, uh, or this kind of art. Mm -hmm. um, but it, you know, I love color and I use acrylics and oils and um, create these things that just are in my imagination. And uh, that's it. The yeah. color is beautiful. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, thank you thank so you. much for having us. Okay. And we have one final artist here with us this morning, Kirk, over here. You have massive pieces and I kind of Oh, heard, thank you so much. Yeah, I kind of heard like a little glimpse of your conversation. When you make pieces like this, you kind yes. of, you do it all at, at once. Yes, I do. The, so these, this is a called a triptych when it's three paintings makes one okay and so I do them all as one. Oh, cool when it so the continuity of those all together make one piece and they're separated obviously but um, that's how they're intended to be mm -hmm. um, yeah when did you it's what fantastic. is this type of artwork called how did you get involved in well this? generally it's called abstract expressionist okay but there's all you know different techniques that I'm using on my own I'm trying to make these unique and I also do collage pieces, wow. uh, as you can see up here, mixed media collage pieces uh, using different elements and so forth Very with cool. words and pictures and uh, torn pieces and all that and then putting paint on them. That's just so awesome. So it's all creative. Yeah. It's 100%. a creative process. And that's, I think, a really good glimpse into how at Zero Empty Spaces, you can come in here and you can see a little bit of art for everyone. Depending on what you like, the chances are there's something really cool here that you will enjoy. So come on oh, out and sure. check it out today. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Again, you can check out Zero Empty Spaces at Bell Tower Shops in Fort Myers. The Working Art Studio is a new addition to the Fort Myers Shops. And their number's right there on your screen. And we have more info for you, too, on our website. Hey, if you got an idea for us, you can always let us know. Hello, Ryan's here, everybody. Hello, Ryan. <laughs>
<laughs> uh, anyhow, uh, ADHD is way out of control right now. Uh, if you got an idea for the segment, let us know about it. Lots of cool stuff.